Hey guys, welcome back to some more Cyberpunk 2077. Can I say something? Oh, I can zoom. How is he? Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. V, you in there? Ah, my head. How you feeling? I don't know, Vic. Ears are ringing, and I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage, and I almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of... hatred. Then I let it all out into a mic, and I realized it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then... <laughs> promise not to laugh. I plant a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Nothing there to laugh about. They killed me, Vic. Never been so afraid. It was too real. Even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. There's a personality construct on that shard. Dreams you had were from his past. Hang Talk on. To me. You mean to say there's an actual terrorist in my head? Right now. That's right. Johnny Silverhand. Had his crowning moment about 50 years ago. AHQ bombing. Heard of it? It's his doing. People say he was buried under the rubble. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. I think you can top the terrorist in my brain. The biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much... life. A few weeks tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness. Gradually taking over your body until... one day you'll just be... gone. V, it's important you get all Bro, this. I just feel like I just found out I got cancer. You know what I mean? Like, I, just, I feel like I just got cancer, you know? Like, I'm, I'm sad. V? You'll fix me up, right? Vic? If I could, I would, V. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? Don't admit a thing, not one deep. Okay. There was, is, a construct, a psyche on the chip, that of Johnny Silverhand. You jacked it in your chip slot. Nothing happened, right? Until you died. Bullet in the head from Dexter to Sean. But how do you come back from something like that? Low caliber, you lucked out. Not least thanks to another poor decision by Mr. Deshaun. The nanites off the chip started fixing the damage. 
Then they took your hand and coaxed you off the path toward the light. <laughs> You're Dr. Victor and I'm your monster. Perfect. Your body's only a body. You can modify it, replace it with chrome, hell, get a new one altogether. Your mind, though? Well, that's a whole nother story. From the biochip's perspective, your brain cells are a tumor that needs to be scooped out, while your body's an empty shell to hold the construct. So this fucking terrorist wants to wipe me and take my place, take my body. It's not willful on his Process. part, it's automatic, inevitable, and neither of you can stop it. I'm getting a little emotional over here, man. This is... Talk Fuck. to me. I don't know what that is. I remember this thing. Saw it on TV. What was that stupid slogan? Soul something? Secure your soul. But that's it. It's just supposed to let you communicate with constructs. Maybe, but this is a prototype by the look of things. Somehow made it out of Arasaka Labs. Can't we just take the chip out? Or switch it off? Either way is out of the question. You die immediately. Bro. Vic, you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... Well, what the hell do I do? Tell me, please. Vic. I wish I knew, kid. Misty? You're asking too much from an old-timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. Bro, oh, this is nuts. I just started the game and I found out I'm died. dying. <laughs> and I thought I was gonna feel like crap now. With him in my sleep. Oh, man, and Jackie died. Sleep's a small hint of death. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here. Got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudoendotrizines from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. Giving me a pill to prod that son of a bitch so he can kill me faster? Listen, you're likely to be fine for a while. But sometime down the road, it could turn into pure agony. I'm giving you options, honey. The brain could be tricked. Plain old painkillers do that. Your psyche's gonna die, V. You'll feel your old self slipping away. At some point, you won't recognize yourself. It'll be terrifying. It'll be painful. But it doesn't have to be. The fuck I need pills for? Ought to just stick a gun in my mouth and pull the trigger. Well, that way you'd kill two souls. Is that what you want? Oh man, when she puts it like that. I gotta lie down. Here, got one more thing for you. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? Promise you'll try to get some sleep? 
You're lovely, Misty. Thanks. Good night, V. Sweet, peaceful dreams. I guess there's nothing else to do but sleep, right? Damn. This is crazy. I, I know I keep saying that, but this is crazy. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Gotta get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way, you included. Oh shit. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? Don't smoke. Then go out and get some. Just need one last one. Jesus fucking Christ, man. The fuck kind of joy toy are you supposed to be? Fucking ghost off! Bro, he looks badass. It says talk to the stranger. Oh. Who you work for? Start talking! Fuck. Fuck. Bro, this is trippy. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No, wait. I'll take control. I'll find a way. Oh my you god. You hear me? This is this is actually starting to get scary. See you never, asshole. Now like that, stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger. I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. I'm like mold on fruit creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out, I'm out there, there somewhere. somewhere. Gotta, Gotta be. be. Wait. <sighs> fuck, 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 fucking fuck. Leave me alone. Get out, just get the fuck out. Led to the head, only thing that will fix this. Hear me, asshole? A bullet to the fucking brain. Fuck me. Act two. Oh, 
looks like I'm playable again. It says I'm carrying too much, so go ahead and I'm probably going to skip past all this. All right, so just go over what I got here. Um, set them up with uh, this outfit here. Uh, it was just the best rated equipment. I did make this weapon here. Um, I did increase this to nine. I think it was the only one I increased. Actually, I increased it quite a bit. Uh, I unlocked these two things here. Um, and then in here, I unlocked this and this. And then I want to say I got this. I think that was it, honestly. All right, so let's just get back to the game then. my rent wonder if I actually have to pay my rent see if this does anything I doubt it welcome to n54 news all right I don't want to do this I've kind of been I haven't really done anything I don't want to get back to the action Let's see, you got anything in here? Pistol ammo. Um, let's see, jobs maybe? Okay, so we, do we go to, we go to journal? Thank you. Yeah. Playing for time. What it looks like we got ourselves into a real fix. No chance in hell we're wriggling ourselves out of this one, but you're still alive. And as Missy says, as long as you're alive, there's hope. Fate's going to give you a second chance. So use it. Get back on your feet. Do that and consider your best friend's last wish fulfilled. All right. You know, so we've done some uh, main stuff and I kind of wanted to do... Oh, these are all okay. So these are all completed. Oh, these are like moderate and very high. Oh, I just want to see what some of this is. Pay off your debt to Victor. All right, this looks like we just have to retrieve something, so let's go 
Go ahead and do that. Oh. Tajemura here. We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. I haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. All right, I guess, uh... Ah, shit! I remember that guy. Is that why he's looking, he looks like that? Shit weather, eh? Oh, it's, it's everything. Everything looks like that. All right, one second. Okay, so now I... I don't know. I don't know if I should do... Open up! Barry! We know you're in there! We're here to help! Don't got no fucking warrant! Cut the bullshit! Just open up! We came here as colleagues. Nothing else. Haven't heard from you in a while. Don't worry. No. Now leave me alone! All right. There's a lot of stuff to do on here. I don't really know. Yeah, I thought this uh, symbol was a feather before, but it's it's a knife. I can't. All right, so I heard that you could. You go in the ring yourself. Not anymore. Skull's taking too much of a beating. Reflexes ain't what they used to. Well, there's ways of fixing that. Korenzikov should do the trick. Rather dish out my eddies for something else. It's time I started taking it easy. How much money? Oh, I have I have quite a bit of money. All right. Well, I I was sitting there thinking I was like maybe I should go make some money, but blunt weapon. I want to stick with the blades. I've been kind of putting points into stuff like that. Hmm. I'm gonna buy one of these because I'm not really sure what they do. Go ahead and we're gonna swap to this. Oh, it doesn't I can't get a mod for it? But I can put a mod on this. Is that gonna make it better? No, it's not. All right, so we're gonna use this for right now. Hey. B! Haven't seen you in a good one, two, few weeks. <laughs> Figured you'd skip town. Just trouble, usual stuff. Ah, ah. In need of iron and lead, then, I take it? Sure, maybe. Let me see what you got. So what I want to see... So these are mods. That's kind of cool. It renders my gun non-lethal. That crit chance one's expensive, so is that other one. Um, I 
I don't know. These increase range, which I'm pretty big on. I, I, I do rush people, but if I can take them out further away. Stuff's expensive. All right. I'm not going to do any of that right now. I kind of want to make some money first. Chang Tao recently expressed interest in the purchase of Pacifica property with the aim of constructing a new server and... Hello, I'm Arif Iqbal with WNS News. Today... Hmm. Let's try that out. And, uh... Got a better silencer. Alright, it's looking like the green gear cannot get like mods or attachments. Could just be the type of weapon. I'm not really sure. The exact cause of his death has not been released, but initial reports suggest coronary implant failure. The remainder of Mayor Ryan's term will be fulfilled by his deputy mayor and closest associate, Weldon Holt. Holt has also announced plans to run for mayor in the upcoming election. Today, we all mourn the untimely loss. Okay, it says I have a message. Here. Okay. Of our mayor. I'm kind of running out of time for this uh, video, so I want to get over here and talk to him before I end it. To look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted that you would survive. What do you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn, what's she to you? She and the Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. Been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? I don't think so, no. Can you expand? <laughs> don't matter how much perfume Macorpo sprays on mornings. By lunch, that's replaced by the stench of skullduggery. Only thing I caught from Evelyn was determination. And I too stink of skullduggery? Nope. You're starting to stink. Period. Hmm. <sighs> Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. 
The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they oh, are now he's talking. Now he's talking. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist. Thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. I'll get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she would not manage to now. Honor Among Thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. If that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Defected? Where to? Some other corp poach him? As far as I can tell, he acted alone. A meticulous man. He planned it. Covered his tracks very well. Any idea where he took off to? None. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. She take you for a suit? No, she saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well-informed, gets wind of most things that happen in the city. 
Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. Dolma is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dickwipe. Hey, it wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. <laughs> 